hot, man. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you're sweating. I'm sweating. You're seeing There's a drop on your nose. If you could zoom in on that, you are dropping. How's it going, New Life? My name's Drew, and welcome back to Hot Topics, where we eat hot wings and talk about hot topics. We're joined here today by Pastor Miles and Pastor Lincoln, our Normandy Park campus pastor and our Maple Valley pastor. How are you guys feeling? Good, a little nervous, um, but it, uh, excited for whatever is gonna happen. It's gonna be fun. Great to be with you, man. The rapid fire round right here is you're gonna take a bite, and I'm gonna ask four questions. Just answer them as quick as you can. So let's jump into the first wing. Let's do it. Okay. First wing, here we go. Big one. I like it. Yeah. Easy one. What's your favorite smell? Purple. It's my favorite smell. Purple. What is? Purple. I don't know. Uh, cinnamon. 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 That's good. That's good. That's good. <laughs> Threw me off with purple. <laughs> Cookies. Cookies. That's a great one. Mm -hmm. If you had the opportunity to award the worst movie in history, which movie would you give it to? Hero with Jet Li. Oh, he had it's a that terrible one. movie. Worst movie? Um, Dumbo. <laughs> wow. I don't know. That's so Dumbo's wrong. Dumbo's a banger, bro. Next one. Whom would you like to live as if you could trade lives with any literary figure? It cannot be Jesus or the disciples. I don't know, man. Tony Stark. Is he a literary figure? Oh, it has to be literal? I said literary, but if you well, want to Robert be Tony Stark, then. Okay. <laughs> if you, you want to be Tony Stark, I'll give you Tony Stark. You already got the fit for it. You, you're, you're well, Iron Man. You got Iron it. Man. Yeah, you got yeah. the you got the physique already. How about you, Miles? Odysseus. I don't know. Someone <laughs> cool. A Greek god? No, he's not a Greek oh. god. No. Oh, what is he? What is Odysseus? I don't even. Okay. okay. Last question. If you had to describe your personality using only a kitchen appliance, what would the kitchen appliance oh, be? Oh my goodness. I don't know, toaster comes to mind. <laughs> I don't know why. You don't need to explain yourself, just whatever. Yeah. Toaster. Air fryer? Oh, that's such a better answer. <laughs> yeah, the one I'm ready. I'm an air fryer. I All right. Back. <laughs> All right, let's jump into the second one then. Mm -hmm. So the second okay. one's going to get a little hotter. Okay. So. Okay. This one looks dirty. <laughs> what was the most embarrassing thing you did when dating your wife? Um, I, didn't, I didn't pay for our first date. Oh. <laughs> and she talks about it to this day. Oh man, <clears throat> where'd you guys go? Yeah, well, we went to Covington Teriyaki. It was one of my favorite um, teriyaki spots, and uh, and I took it. <laughs> we cleaned the church. So I was like, well, if if this is gonna be someone I'm dating, she has to know how to serve. First date, you had her cleaning the church. Yeah, first date. Yeah, yeah. She jokes about that, but wow. <laughs> I was a janitor at the time for the church, also a part-time worship leader. Yeah, and. We were cleaning the church, and afterwards, I'm like, ooh, I like this girl, and get to know her. And so I take her to Covington Teriyaki, and I don't pay for her meal. But but then she said after that date, she went home and told her mom she was going to kick me to the curb. <laughs> Yikes. All right, how about you, Miles? Um, you doing all right, by the way? This is hot. <clears throat> so <clears throat> when I first uh, told my wife that I liked her before yeah. we were dating, um, just getting up the courage to say that was um, was a lot. And so when I was telling her, my eye was like twitching, like like hey, I like you, but like my eye was twitching really like, real bad. And like, really, yeah, she told me that she thought it was cute afterwards, but like it was that's, not intentional at all. No, it's super. Like I'm losing it. I'm, I don't have control right now. But hey, it worked. So your eyes are already watering. <clears throat> it's hot, man. So it's let's go ahead man. and jump into our third wing. I'm getting a little sweaty here already. Mm -hmm. If you were to start a podcast today, what would the title of it be, and what would it be about? <clears throat> Woo. Well, <laughs> come on, you got it. You Are these brain blockers? Like it prevents you from thinking? Brain blockers? That's what your podcast? Uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> the hot sauce. Um, I would probably start a podcast. On Napkin, like... Napkins need to be right there. They just need to be on deck. Okay. Come on, you got the. I would probably <coughs> podcast. <laughs> I would probably start a podcast on something theological, interviewing other people that study the Bible, talking about theology, Bible, current days, society. People in the community. I would enjoy that. 
Woo! All right, Miles, get it out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Moments with Miles, and the same thing as what he said. <laughs> you got a title. What's your title? I don't know, man. I, Just whatever, whatever comes to mind right now, quick. Build, build now, build people. <laughs> Lincoln's logs. Lincoln, Lincoln's, Lincoln's, no, no. Lincoln's logs. Lincoln's logs. <laughs> Lincoln's right, digital quick. logs. Hey, quick, quick. Uh, we're gonna show you a photo. Individually, we'll show you each one. You have to describe what's going on in that partic particular uh, photo. Lincoln, you're up first. I actually feel lightheaded. Woo! Oh! <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> It reminds me of the, the dark stage of my life. What's going on in that photo? What's going on in the photo? Yeah. Well, that's a photo when I had hair longer than Pastor Miles here. Yeah, way longer. I was living on a, a, a floor with a bunch of other people in the LA Dream Center. And I had long hair down to here because I thought I was native for a very long time. <laughs> lie detector detected, that was a lie. Tell them how you found out you weren't native. Yeah, well, I did Ancestry.com and about 20 years of my life, I thought, oh, I'm, I look the way I am because I'm native. My dad said we were native, and he yeah. even showed me pictures of my native Cherokee princess grandmother. Well, I took Ancestry.com, and I'm 0% native. So <laughs> so did you cut the hair right after that? Um, I actually did. Wow. I, I was living a lie for 20 years of my life. Miles, are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Describe what's going on in this particular photo. Oh, it's me laying in bed <laughs> with food. Maybe a chicken nugget on a fork. I'm pretty sure I'm on a cruise in that moment. So I'm actually kind of proud of that. You guys ready for the last wing? No. You guys doing okay? No. So a big, big bite. This is the last dab. Wow. I am cooking right now. Let's go. Um. No, you cannot have milk. No, that's not. Is this one hotter than the last one? <laughs> it's actually uh, not. I feel like it's you're just lying gonna, to It's me. a brain trick. But it does say it's. It's, no, it, they, they invented a new pepper. Go ahead, eat the wing. It's eat a new, a new, this. new pepper, a new one. So, oh. for those of you who don't know, I'm cooking. <laughs> Miles and Lincoln did ministry together for quite a while. Yep. Miles was the youth pastor at Maple Valley. So, considering you both did ministry together for quite a while, what's one of your most memorable <laughs> memories during that time? Uh, uh, memorable memory? Oh god. Sure. <laughs> what is your memorable ex memorable experience? You know, <clears throat> I know we've given us some funny answers, but I'm gonna give a solid one. We went through COVID together, you know, through all the stuff in 2020, and uh, gotta give it, <clears throat> get hats off to Pastor Lincoln. He led our campus well, led our staff well during that time. Oh, it was really hard, so but so he hit. He hit. Uh, <laughs> Are you crying? I'm, just, I'm, just, oh. no, I'm, I'm crying not because it was emotional. Okay. I'm crying because okay. it's hot. That's so sweet. Are you gonna stay in that same vein, sentimental? Or are you? Or are you? Uh, he's going for the ice cream, everyone. Oh, feels a lot better. Just to give you guys a heads up, Lincoln is on oh, a cut right now. On a cut. He's, I can't eat it. He's eating these wings, but he won't eat any of that, so he's only allowed to touch his lips. We almost thought about getting ice soup, but we passed. Ice Light soup. Um, Some call that water. It is. Any water. Can I grab water? Yes. <coughs> Miles is very shaky. <sighs> mm. I wouldn't have done that, bro. Mm. That just mm. spreads it around. All right. Mm. What is a memorable experience you had mm. at mm. Maple Valley working with Lincoln? Wow. Sorry, with Miles. Bro, you're sweating. I'm sweating. You're seeing double? There's a drop on your nose. If you could zoom yeah. in on that, you are dropping. I am. So it's called dripping drop? Okay. Ooh, that does make it worse. Ooh, ow. I told you. I told you I feel back up. Woo! <laughs> Look at the camera real quick and say build now. Build now. And now tell us your memorable experience. <laughs> A memorable experience with Miles. Come on, man. Um, he, just, oh! he just opened up his heart and you're... Come on. Okay, so I'll say this. Uh, Miles was an incredible youth pastor. Well, I legitimately lightheaded. Um, incredible youth pastor. In fact, one, a memorable one was I just had a meeting with our youth past, or with our with our summer camp leaders. <laughs> About to cry. With our summer camp leaders, and and eighty percent of them were all students that went through his uh, ministry. <clears throat> and so they used to be students, and now they're leading in summer camp. Love the Lord. They're uh, helping save people for Jesus. Yeah. They're um, great influences. Good Bible theology. <laughs> 
And so shout out to Pastor Miles' leadership because it's about the fruit of the ministry, right? Yeah. It's about making disciples, not just making salvations. And so honestly, that meant a lot to me. Yeah. That's beautiful. And now we're here right. eating wings together. <laughs> and now we're here. I'm proud of you guys. You guys have Thanks. done well. So how we're gonna end this, you guys will go ahead and look at the camera. Tell New Life you love him. Hit him with one more build now if you need to. And just go ahead and say goodbye. We From all you. of us here at New Life. We love you. staff. We love you. With the whole heart. With our whole so heart. To my daughter. Uh, willing to throw our bodies on the line for a few minutes of entertainment. Yeah. So. We hope you enjoy it. Honestly, uh, we love you. <laughs> Anything for your entertainment. No. Um, Thank you for investing in us. Thank you for investing in, in New Life. And we wouldn't be here if New Life wasn't such a great church and empowering us to do ministry and pastor men, women, and children in our communities. Don't forget, build now. Also, I've, <clears throat> I've right. cleaned more bone than Woo! Guys, than it's been has. so good it's hanging out with you guys. Um, but we thank you guys for tuning in to uh, Hot Topics. We hope you guys like this episode. Um, feel free to check in. Last episode, we had Eric and Lori. Otherwise, we look forward to another episode. We'll see you guys later. Have a great day. This was hot. Mm. This, was, this was really hot. Honestly, I, I, I legitimately, it was hot in my mouth, but like my brain hurts right now. So, to so give it 24 hours. So I feel lightheaded. It, it engages your sweat glands. I feel sweat. Sweat perspiration, perspiration. I'm serious. Um, but, but I'm doing okay. You know, I'm doing alright. <laughs> and there's what's called the afterburn. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like you're not acknowledging it. <laughs> it said 24 hours, and Lincoln just goes, "Yeah, yeah spicy yeah. food." It is. <laughs> Listen, I'm just grateful. <laughs> I'm just grateful to eat. We food. got him. We got Drew. We got him. Oh, I'm, just, I'm just grateful that I won both the tortilla challenge <laughs> it was just a and look. I won the spicy challenge. Uh, look at number three. Look at that. Look at that. I got a three. Oh, oh you're he's go going back. again. He's going back. All right, All right now. Ah, you catch it up. <clears throat> well, it's been I'll great, y'all. It's been great.